Says yay loading screens. Oh, so yay redoing things that I already did, technically. But welcome to Empire of the Ants. Just the screen moves this down a bit. So, Empire of the Ants. Firstly, audio. Lower these down a bit more. By the way, dialogue. Yeah, I don't think dialogue is actually a thing. But yeah. So Empire of the Ants. Basically, I attempted doing this earlier. Then I uninstalled it. For a few reasons. Because A, there's a collection thing. Yeah, a collection thing. B, the collection thing sort of sucks because the way they designed this. It's a lot of, okay, do this mission. By the way, there's one collectible on it. By the way, mission's over. You missed the collectible. You, you can't go back and redo the mission. At least that's what I thought. I was we just let the menu play out. That's the thing we could do. But yeah, I didn't realize you could technically go back and replay missions. I didn't realize it because it's on the main menu and not, you know, where you dispatch it to be in game. <coughs> oh, she's still sick. But yeah. So. Basically, a lot of the missions I miss collectibles on, and got very irritated with the collect the whole collectibles because some of them were like, "Okay, do this, do this." It's like you're doing the objectives, and then the mission's done. Whoop, miss collectible. I thought you'd have to restart the entire game, basically to go back over for collectibles, which would really suck because this is like a twenty-hour game. So let's say you went 18 hours and then, well, you missed one collectible. Well, you're a bit fucked then. That's what I thought. Apparently, there is a mission replay. The thing about the mission replay, though, is it takes you back to, like, yeah, like, back to your previous area. Which means there's still technically missions that you could, like, just in case you didn't do all the missions before moving on. But yeah, it means you could technically go back and try to get collectibles. I think? I think. I haven't actually tried it. But yeah, I think, because yeah. Fucking golden tortoise beetles. Though, a bit bigger than an ant. They were like, see there's ants? They were like this big. They are like basically about the size of a tooth. Or a rock. Well, rocks could be any size, but yeah. About the size of like, well, what are you standing on that? So, a little bit bigger than an ant, but still, it's hard to find if I could go to Taurus Beetle. But yeah, that's what I was missing mostly. Because I thought there was like the butterflies, because yeah, phone though it's you only get the monarch butterflies. I hope butterflies just fly away and I was spinning entirely too long just... Oh, I'm going to jump at this butterfly. And I land right next to it and it just fly away. I get close, it fly away. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway. New story. So here's the thing. Gonna replace this one. I think we, we might still keep our collection boards. I don't know if there's a way to reset that. But I don't really care. I can re-earn the collection boards now that I know what to do. But anyway. This game's 
it doesn't know what it wants to be. It's like it wants to be exploration, but it also wants to be RTS. But it has some bare, some simple, slightly complex, but yet very simple RTS mechanics. They're very, pretty much rock, paper, scissors. That pretty much sums up the majority of the RTS things. Like, oh no, those gunners. Well, then you send workers. Oh no. Those workers, well then you send warriors. Oh no, those warriors, then you send gunners. Basically, three for things that count each other. That's also over in it. Over. You uh, know, that you can team up with eventually to get them to help alliances and all that. Which I haven't reached that point yet, but. Adds a bit more layers to it. You can accept defenses, you can accept resource gathering things, sort of. But yeah, it's... It's definitely a thing. Definitely... A bit complex, yet simple. Confusing what it's trying to be. At least it looks pretty as shit. The whole Unreal five engine. Oh no, the firebugs. And then the firebug nation attacked. Oh no, the green beetles. Oh no, the rhino beetle. A snail. We can take a snail, right? I mean, if we had like maybe a thousand more, we could push over the snail. But yeah, I don't think I don't think we're gonna get that snail. That's a butterfly. flies off. So yeah. Butterfly. Anyway, first hunt. Western barrel can. Nest was already defend the nest when the barrel is destroyed. Also, one of the fun things is like when I was watching this originally, where was it? Not sure if it was It's a lot of tips. Oh yeah, upgrading material requires a chemical laboratory or chemical library. It's like, wait, what the fuck is that? Why do ants have chemical laboratories and libraries? Exactly. So anyway, chase the butterfly. Welcome to the awkwardness that is being an ant. There's a thing. We can move. We can move under things. Problem always like screw to the camera when you go under things. Also, apparently we do keep our collection. Isn't that great? So that's gonna confuse me. Cause I already technically have that butterfly. Also Butterfly. Lesser flying creature. It's wide and covered for wings or delicacy. Perhaps you got some of them feed on carrion. Note. Won't well, worry after this one. Do not worry about that one. That one's just a waste of your time. 
dragonfly, set on prayer, hunt small creatures faster than any other person around. Same kind of interest by kind. It's not like, you know, the Empire of the Undergrowth one that was like, hey, I'm just going to swoop down and be, you know, mini boss or boss anyway. Also, work her. Red by brown tavern, perfect for gathering, collecting resources, tending aids, and lower constructing. Strong as guns, weak against warriors. Warrior red by powerful mandibles, fast, powerful, close combat specialist. Strong as warrior uh, workers, weak against gunners. And gunners red by green adrenaline. Gunners for decimate warrior runs with a formidable acid, weak against workers. Nest guards, defense red were redwood ant nests. Termites, orange red white by. Workers, warriors, gunners, nest guards. What is that with any of these creatures? A wall, a meal, a home. Bello, Bello Kinikani, the founder and queen of Belkan. We were the Federation we prayed and adored by many. Bello Kinikuni, the name and title for the Federation and the leader. Then there's Taiyani. It was just the queen of Tyenicon. Don't worry about that yet. Then there was a uh, Pasius, which is a clever creature. Many of these insects know a language and are able to infiltrate our cities. They'll go food, children, attention for workers, stay alert. There was a door, be your cover for prayer, very strong, calm, capable of any many of at once. The going towards beetle, that's what it looks like. Gotta be on the lookout for those things. So and here's a sign of good luck among Balakanian sisters. Can be eaten. Play bug. Pest. Hunter or aphid herds. Should be killed on sight. Firebug. Let a creature walking meat with red shell and black rock. Can attract unseasoned and isolated. Can attack unseasoned and isolated ants. The pale bug could be prey. Cause it's a ball to avoid danger. Not worth the hassle to open up and eat. Water strider. Slash so a water bug. Found on calm rivers and sail by water. Aphids, that's a creature that produces a delicious honeydew. Use a badger hero allegiance. About to be useless in combat. Remember that. Slug, that's a creature, less a snail, slimy, slow, idiotic, easy prey. <coughs> <coughs> Bone we let us a fluffy creature, flies from flower to flower, cutting and our feet's gone. Gentle and noisy animals not to be disturbed. And. Mmm, surprise prayer, using its legs to jump and hop at hops. Hunts quickly. Be on guard at all times. Then we fell moment spring is here from white stuff just coming the two or after this could be a bad sign. Uh it's traditional motor flood. I missed one. Anyway, ultra scans. We're getting to the scans when we get to the scans. But yeah. Okay. It's after cold, humid, and sunny. Oh, no, there's no fall damage, so just a line and jump. I don't remember. Yeah, because there was a thing to scan. I'm not sure about the collection hill. If it's a memory fail mode, or if it is a going tour speed. It probably is a going tour speed on this level, so I'm actually going to take time to actually look properly around this time. Because, you know, going to fucking tour speed. Suppose we can't really go fast yet. But yeah, I'm gonna have to take the time to look around for these things. I'm not seeing anything golden. Yeah, there's a prey. And there it goes. Did you know there are it could be hidden anywhere, hell. Oh god, yep, that's why I hate. Yeah, the way you attach to things, you can end up easily looping in a circle trying to get off things. Especially small things like leaves or twigs. 
you know, just going in a circle around the thing constantly. But yeah. <coughs> I don't know what they're going towards. <coughs> Either way, if there even is one, it could just be a memory fail now. No, it's not the butterfly, anyway. That would mess up. I think that's just a war. Yeah, that's a war right over there. Which, by the way, we could get closer. Nope, we, we hit the water. This is gonna happen a lot. Especially on the net set of levels after this area. We're going to end up dying a lot because water. Because water sucks. Water's our natural enemy. Especially when you think you can make a simple jump, but you end up overshooting. Way too easy to overshoot. Way too easy to undershoot. There, yeah, we could just climb under the thing. <coughs> Not just. <coughs> Wait, is that? <coughs> I think that's just a rock. I could be wrong, bro. Chat point reach. Yeah, that's just for a log. Mm. I was going towards speed. Where would I be? Probably back at the very start. Oh, you dick. No, it's definitely not downhill. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think they would put in... That's not where I would want you to go. Go on, hurry, hurry. Oh, he barely survived. I don't think they would put it there. Well. Oh, apparently we got close enough. And now apparently we no longer care about, you know. The record butterfly. Well, we no longer care. We need to go talk to the sister. Oh, so we can run. By the way, running is useful yet also one of the worst mechanics in the game. Cause running literally yeets you off things into the abyss. So you can go very fast, but at the same time. No. Anyway, let's talk. Hey, come closer. Hey, come closer. 103683. You seem disoriented. Maybe they'll walk around and wake you up. What's going on? Two unknown objects that need to be investigated. Any idea what they, what they could be? There are more than two parts spirits, you might want to start with the structure close by. It goes quite deep under the ground. A lot of sisters could be in there. So when did you wake up? This morning, we went out with the first group. Soon the whole city will be starving, so we should hurry up. Get me resources of food, so I your poor sleepy sisters back at Barakhan. So who else is awake from us? So the Petra and small birds, some flies as well, nothing serious. Do you want to wake up around the same time as us? Good thing they live far away. I shall go find the unknown objects. Welcome to our task. We must go scan the two unknown objects. Thing is, I've technically already done that, so they're technically already in my collection. But, you know, we should do this. You know. So this here is the point of interest. Basically, you want to go collect 
These little white glowy nodes that you can barely see. They're hovering around this thing. I know they should have changed it to a different color that was more noticeable. But yeah. Boop. Huzzah. So now then. Oh, it's a collection. Scans. This is a huge film. It's a very large but light object. Lever scan, hollow inside. Careful, no smell, not animal lever. There's also... We'll deal with that once we get to it. Oh, there's also a snail. Uh, slug. Light slug. He's just a slug. He's doing slug things. Anyway, the problem though is, you know, okay, so the area is limited by, well, yeah, if we get too far, it's like, well, we had a visible wall, basically. So here's what my problem. Okay, so. We don't want to find a going towards people. Problem though is, I have no fucking idea where it could be. There's no real indicators, it's just sort of go wander aimlessly until you find one. Have fun. I'll try to have a salmon system which is running low. And I'm just going all over the white place, ain't I? Also, yeah, as I said, you can change your view distance. Now, the one is go over there and look at the pail. But firstly... Far away. No, I can't go that far. Okay. That's too far, too. I mean, visually, it, it's it's definitely pretty. Gameplay-wise, could be a bit better. That's a ladybug. A yellow one. I was a lady bird. I'm not sure if they just made that sort of different distinction though in this. More ladybugs. My quest continues to find, I don't know, I hope it's just that. Could be a memory pheromone, which is also a thing. It's hard to play tell. Now that's too far. Nothing? Well, maybe if it's up. How? No, I can't go that far. Damn. Okay, okay, we're, we're looping. We're looping. Well, there's a good ocean beyond any of the plants, too, potentially, which would be. Oh, just the worst. Just the worst. All oh, right, the butterfly. I forgot about the fucking butterfly on this level. Oh, to be fair, I already got, so I don't really have to worry about it. But yeah. So, 
Yeah. This is where I struggle. This is where I struggle. Because it's, you know, collectibles and not seeing anything. Sort of sucks. I was basically looking for like a golden rock in the middle of all this. Easier said than done. Be fair, and maybe it's not even a golden beetle hill. Yeah, maybe it's not even a golden bead. The problem though is, I have no idea. I was going by what I would assume it, we're going, we're looking for. Anything up, Hal? No, it doesn't look like it. What about on this thing? No. Okay, how about over here? No. Uh oh, okay. Oh, well, that was a dumb. Thanks. Let me go back. Just yee myself off into the abyss. <sighs> anyway. The problem is, it could literally be fucking anywhere. And I hate the fact that, you know, I'm missing just one collectible, and I have no idea where to look. God, we're gonna spend entirely too long on this first tutorial mission, because there's one collectible, and it's, you know, I don't know what it is. A slug? Slug, have you seen a golden beetle? I haven't. Oh, hi, Albert Slug. Have you seen a golden beetle? You, you made a slug trail. Why did I reinstall this? I don't know. Okay. We.
You're not going to be a YouTuber, you ladybug. I think they were put like the first one. You know, some a little more obvious. So you know what you're looking for, you know? <sighs> Blarg. Okay, okay. Maybe I should deal with a. Well, where's the butterfly at? I don't even know where the butterfly's at now. I'm not sure if I can get to the butterfly. Usually the butterfly flies around occasionally. There's the tail. We'll look at the power shortly. Of course, I can't even get to the lady, but, uh, butterfly. Might be outside the area. Eh, it's outside the area, isn't it? Huh. Yeah, that's definitely outside the area. I think the butterfly we're after is already considered dead. I think. Because the one I was after, uh, I think it landed like on one of those limbs and those branches, and I jumped at it, and it died. I think, yeah. I don't think we have to worry about butterflies. We have to worry about these fucking beetles. The only problem, though, is... I have no idea. I feel like I'm just going to end up wasting the entire video just looking for them. There's no guides yet, so, yeah. It's just sort of... I'm uh, go look for the thing. I didn't know where to look for the thing. I have no idea where to look for the thing. Did the la Did the log just fart? Huh. But yeah. Going too fast, thing. That's gonna be a recurring issue. Like, if we had like a sensor or a ping, oh, one well, of those, this. But I don't think it detects those things. It's supposed to detect over amps, which. By the way, not detecting over amps. Do you see any shiny go gold in the distance? Because I'm not really seeing anything. Not really seeing anything.
Ah, oh, fine, let's go look at the pal. back and do stuff. The problem though is I don't want to do that because I know I'm going to miss the fucking collectible. The problem though is I have no idea where this collectible is. And it infuriates me. Not just a simple, and oh, that sucks, it just, yeah. <sighs> Thing is, it could be that. It could totally be that. Spring is here and Barricon kind of wakes up, discovering that the tremors are reactive. This could be a bad sign. But yeah, pow. Large fruit, high fruit, true. Slab or soft skin, easy to uh, open, grainy flesh, easy to carry. Careful for minutes correctly. So, yeah. That's what we're looking for. Something like that looks like that. Oh no, that could be fucking anywhere. But if we're just looking for something like that's slightly gold. But as I said, that could be literally anywhere. I did not mean to eat myself off, but that's the thing about running. And this is running just yeets you into every off everything. Alright, let's get some height. Alright. See anything that looks gold in the distance? Or even render in the distance? Good question. Yeah, that's a huge trail. That's where we need to go back to. That's the pail. Which is technically a food source. And yeah. But I got nothing. But anger. But anger. I think I'm basically gonna, it's been 40 fucking minutes. I think I'm gonna basically pause the video and look on my own time. So yeah, we'll be back. How the hell would I have found this asshole? Hey, going towards Fetal. Yay, five out of five. But yeah, so I wandered aimlessly and aimlessly and aimlessly and aimlessly. And then finally, I spotted him on the fog. Yeah, I know. 
That's gonna suck for the light emissions. That's also look at the collective. That's at least one, two, three, four, potentially. Anyway, now we could go advance the game. Yay! Now that we no longer have to, you know, spend another 30 minutes looking for a freaking going tiger beetle on this level. Gate work 103 said tape 3. But some sisters are still missing. Do you mind finding out where they are and assess the situation for me? Any danger to report enemies? Nothing yet, the forest is slowly waking up. The bees are still asleep and the spiders haven't been spied yet. Should not encounter any resistance for now. What about food? What about the food? Since you label the food with, go try our sister from the sea. He trusts us to catch you tasks. Leave the heavy water to our fellow candy and sisters. Anything else to report? Got room to an expedition. But since the city is eager to wake up, our oh, has been plan has plans for us. Big plans. Oh, our sisters can't be too far. We gotta go find them. I was watching the memory pheromone. You know the memory pheromone, which we already technically have, but we have to go over here and we have to watch it now. While we were searching for food, we encountered termites. A fight ensued. Termites so close to Pelican was certainly surprising. And concerning. Well, there you go. But well, we get with this threat swiftly, overpowering them two to one. And now we go back. Up. We have food, most of us are safe, and we defended our territory. But what about the termites? All down the first day when we woke up in winter, these are good signs. What have to head back to Barracon? No report from Barracon? I would predict the stage. They're waking up, my was already talking about his position. Just great plans for us, you know. She wants us to explore the end of the world. Any wounded? I feel one could not make the turn back. She would die soon enough. We should be fine. We did good today. It basically sounds like the others already came back when we missed finding them. But anyway, what do you think? Pride, joy, pleasure, warmth, loyalty. Belkan is not just a city, it's the heart of our mighty federation. Together we are stronger, sister. Right away. Oh now then, time to go back to Belkan. Belkan. We definitely have the Nyum. Definitely have the Nyum. Wee. Woo. Ugh. <sighs> Present a gameplay tower five based on Bernard Warper Saga. Oh, look at that big ass ant mount. Empire of the Ants.
Also, which one of you ass hats decided, hey, we're gonna add these golden torture speed or to find? Because I'm so irritated about those. Alright, and then those missions for us to replay. I was just, just saying we've already done basically things here. So yeah, like, we've already technically scoured this pine cone. We... We're missing one thing. It's probably, you know... It's probably either a memory fail mode, or... Yeah, probably one of those. But anyway, scans. So pine cone. It's free from a pine tree, perfect for hiding or building dams, careful This thing can easily trap sisters. Also, these hills were in later in flood area, which we'll go to after we finish with Barracon. So, it's this round black structure is an unknown origin, unknown purpose. Bits are easy to teleport. The entire structure is surprisingly solid. Do not eat. Do not transport back to nest. The translucent structure, unknown order, unknown purpose. Materials are shouldn't be sold and inedible. Careful and summer dread sound like can result in instant death. But anyway, yeah, the flood. The flood. <sighs> so yeah, at least we don't have to worry about butterflies for a while. But yeah, golden tortoise speed or spade in my existence. I'm pretty sure it's what we're after. But now I'm uphill. Okay, while we're, while we're uphill. Do you see anything? There's the ants moving. Mm -hmm. More ants moving. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Two hours three collection. Do I talk to him after I get the collectible? Ah. Huh. Interesting. Interesting. Anyway, so, we have a limited exploration area. I don't think I'm very allowed past this point. But ye Ow. I hit the wall. The problem though is, you know, be fucking anywhere. I guess we should probably go talk to them, shouldn't we? No chance, so totally. like we've been sitting on expedition. Don't warm over your way, personal resources for a federation. Oh, good luck. So you. What's up? 
Hello, I'm Nat, and a friend of Barrowcon. The fact that you have, like, that thing, it says collectible on you. Hmm. I'll go into the water. No, no man, we couldn't make it. I don't really worry about, like, you know, the mosquito. That butterfly that I tried getting to, like, probably over training times, it's just there to do things, not actually a thing to collect. Not a monarch butterfly after all. So don't worry about it. Sup. I said sup. Oh yeah, wake one no three six eight three. Take your time to eat something and clean yourself before heading out. Outside the forest is coming back to life. Any poor about the city? Expeditions are left through the border of the Federation. The mention came from a simple question from Upper. Have you ever asked yourself what lies beyond the forest? The rest of us here, sister, the rest of sister. Barricon is waking up. Why are some people awake? I don't want to. We slowly wake up at our own pace. Some of us never do. I was already laying eight. A new generation is about to spawn. Thank you, 42. Alright, so remember the rule. Just constantly keep on the lookout for something gold and shiny. I can't tell if that's a fact. I hope I just rock. Oh, these are wet rocks and it makes it them look shiny. And shiny on wet rocks is a Oh. Could you be. No, you're just a stick. You're just a stick. Why am I going to just a stick? It's just a stick. There was nothing on the stick. See? There was nothing on it. Oh god, why not I'm second guessing over here? Ow. Well, that's just. That, that's coming outside the pipe for a wall. Is there anything up here on the plant? No. The problem though is, you know, it could be fucking anywhere. That's the worst part about this, is it literally could be anywhere. Have it might not even be a beat, or it could just be a memory one. The memory fail moments are a bit hard to see too. So easy to say, hey, it's probably one of those. The problem though is finding one of those is... Yeah. Good luck finding one of those. Ow. Too close to the wall. They're too close to the wall. Let's see how far away I can go over here. Not that far. Okay.
Ah, here's a memory thing, well. So this here was the first expedition memory. I'm a weak male prince. I, a weak male prince, was sent on an expedition with 28 warrior sisters to find a winterless paradise. Okay, you want to elaborate more on that? No? Just, that's what happened, apparently. Did you hear? More termites were reported. Unusual. They tend to wake up after us and before the bees. Termites? We usually mind the first to wake up, yet the forest seems to be busy already. Of course, the termites were heard back in the city, but they live so far away. What could have happened? No idea the city is still waking up. Apart from an expedition, most of our scouts are just about to lead Barrowcon. Let's hope those reports report were exaggerated. Okay. So. That was the first expedition one. Collection. Memory thanks. Mmm. So here's the thing. I'm thinking it might actually be a memory fail mode. The problem though is... What the fuck is a memory fail mode be? Hmm. It could be down here somewhere. Oh, so we're not allowed inside. Sadly. I guess I figured the camera would be too hard to control if you went actually inside the thing. Maybe it's a memory film on and not a beat on after it then. The problem is, where the hell would the memory film on be? There's our first at mission. Huh. Oh, the one on the top's like, you know, this. Not the first one, then. Or the memory film one, I would be closer to where you actually start, wouldn't I? So I like hurt. Like, I would put a memory film mode. Like, you know. Some place over like hell. The place where it wouldn't be as easy to miss. Everything out seems to be. So which one were you? Turn to the return vacation. Yeah, like I would put the film on some place over here, but it doesn't appear to be anything. Besides looking for, you know, freaking beetles. The problem is the damn thing could be literally anywhere. Check this log. I'm 
not saying anything. Nothing here, nothing there, nothing anywhere. Ugh. <sighs> Large. Yeah, that would be a quest. I'm not ready to go deal with the first outpost. But I'm trying to get, you know, this last collectible. Which may or may not be anywhere over right here. Maybe it's on the other side of the nest. Okay, so yeah, that's why I found memory from it. Like, seen that from far away? Yeah, no. No. Flying predator, a powerful and aggressive creature, always very busy. A social creature that shows many physical traits for bats. Does it though? Okay, so. I'm not sure if I would consider it bad game design, but it's definitely, it's definitely an annoying choice they made. Oh. Oh, don't tell me you're in here somewhere. I know you're just you. Oh. Oh. Wait. What? Wait, what? Are those just what my... 
Apparently this is just where we store these things. Once we collect them in this cave. In this dark, dark cave. That means those are literally ones we've already collected and not, you know. <sighs> not what we're looking for. I know, I, I, I partially died inside. Cause like, hey, we found them. No, that's just a cave where we keep the ones we've already found. It's not, you know, it's not what we're looking for. Much to my dismay. Oh god, I'm looping again. Ugh, that sucks. That sucks a lot. Stupid. Cause like this whole time I was like two or three collections. I didn't even notice this in front of I didn't even notice that at all. Tenders are positioned on top of the city and they're ready for any incoming threats. I didn't even notice this one at all. Yeah, it's literally right hell. Literally right hell. Congrats, now we know that. Yay. We know these other ones. Yay. So we have a collection, three out of three. Yay. Hi. I'm an ant. So oh, there you go, he's an ant. That an ant. That was good something new with all that collection, but yeah. Completely missed that one. Completely missed that one. <sighs> Great fun for the first time of the season, you must be proud. Spring is a crucial moment for us to <coughs> <coughs> we've received reports about whenever other hunting outposts. Don't worry about enemies, not for too serious, but your help is needed. What kind? Termites! They were seen this morning, they also woke before us. Let me tell what goes once more time before the city wakes up a child. Located right in the middle of Firebug Turtle. But not as many as termites, but still threat to our sisters. More about the many for our alpha outposts, right through the Federation. You cannot lose it. So why we need it? Well, for organizing the first of our fire resource gathering potential. Hunters get our food well, less experienced workers to strip here. Please, I just keep the federal ship's hands wide. Okay. Safety numbers, I'll meet you though. Yeah, I can't believe I fucking missed that. We were literally right in front of the posse. Literally right in front of it. And now I couldn't find that. Uh, so, welcome to our base. Uh, now we're tutorial thing. Oh, so by the way, when I. Collection 01. So by, as you can figure out, 
Yeah, it's probably a going tortoise beetle. If you had to make any educated guesses, it's probably going tortoise beetle. There's a resource in the top right corner now. So he fetches it the cave. Quick. If I were to go in tourist speed, I'd be I'd probably be over here or somewhere. Yeah, you know, that's where I would put it. So the game wants you to, you know, go over there. And, you know, we have our warriors, we have our gunners. Tutorial land. We don't want to do a tutorial yet. But you busy looking for freaking go to tour speeders. Cause you know, the game's a dick like that. Yeah, you know, fucking go to tour speeders. Could be anywhere. And you don't want to do the objectives because you do the objective mission ends and then you can't find go to tour speeders. I know, right? Wait, wait, what's that? That is a sun dot. Alright. So, yeah, tutorial land. Okay. We're not gonna worry about tutorial. We're gonna go. Nope, too far. If I were going towards me, where would I be? Nope, too far. A pill behind this? Hmm. Also, I ditched around way too much on this one trying to get fucking butterflies too. I don't see the butterfly right now. But yeah, the butterfly they kept going over here. And I, oh, there he is, there was the butterfly. Been entirely too long to catch that butterfly. What well, if I was going towards Beetle? I think I see him. I think I see him. There's a going towards Beetle. That's a decent spot for a going towards Beetle. If you look at the right angle, he's easy to spot, but at the same time. He's, you know, out of the way. Yay. We did it. We destroyed the first outpost. That one was easy. Anyway, do to do to do. Let's go. Ooh, wood resource. Let's go do our, you know, our priority now. Okay, so. You guys go over here. Okay, so now that we switch to our gunners and send our gunners to the green area. Which would actually help better if I could see on that trajectory. There we go. So now then, so that your warriors can command them to attack. Oh no, the fire bugs. Here's the thing. I'm just gonna, we could actually literally just wait, because we have our gunners up here. But they'll have to come this way towards us, right? Yes. Which means they'll come towards us to be in range with the gunners. There we go. And then the battle ensues. It's very amusing watching our warriors just smash them onto the ground and then yeet them into the air. 
So now they move your gun to the green. Okay, now we need to capture the nest. We go so. Oh, they want us to do that in different teams. Because we could technically send the boat over. So yeah, we're gonna send the boat over here. Eventually we'll get pheromone powers and everything will be complicated and yet still simple at the same time. Yeah, this is a good command rock. This will be my command rock. We don't actually do bad ourselves. We basically just direct things from, you know, off vantage point. So we have the greens in the back doing the gun thing. Well, our warriors fight. Pretty simple, pretty straightforward. I'm not entirely sure how much range gunners have, but yeah. And that's just been captured. So now then we go to the nest. Do to do to do to do. Interact. And now it's where it gets a bit more complex, because there okay, we have Legion, we have defense, we have other things, like resources, powers. But we go over here to Legions. And here's the thing. <coughs> Gotta really build one thing at the moment, so let's build workers. Okay, so Worker Legion can get rid of transport trade through the world but they are lost when entering combat. <coughs> Strong as don't much but weak against warriors. The cost of food, spiritual workers, it's good. So yeah. They build workers. Now we have workers. Also alright, oh we should probably speed wait they're not constructed yet. So basically we do this. Oh wait, I I can do this from hell. We hold it. To spend extra food to train them faster. And that works so well. Oh yeah, that's all we can really do, Hill. Okay, so now that we have workers, we send workers to the pine cone. And now we work on defense. Oh, so I'm going to send you guys. Not to there, but to there. Okay. Now we go over here. Back. Okay. So defense. So we have enough resources that we could just build a ward barrier. And we can build nest gunners. Mobilize the gunner and answer service as acid turrets. If any of the nest. So now and the thing though is it's going to take a while for this to build. So basically we go back here to defense and we hold that, yes, wait no, yes, oh, wait, do I just go here and there we go, now we can shut faster, so we basically go all the work at this to make them build faster. Now then, after selecting the legion name of the enemy's legion card. So, what do we have here? We have workers, right? If they're workers, you know, we send basically our warriors. To go them. They already look wounded too, so. And here's the thing, we could technically send our gunners to go deal with them too. So long as they don't actually attack my gunners, that'll be fine. And hey, you guys just keep gathering, it's fine. Now let's go look at the combat. Yeah, they smash them and then they use them. Now we can send all of our leaders to your nest to help them. By the way, that's a dumb thing to do because your workers are, you know, your workers are busy, you know, gathering resources. Why would they go back to hell? But, you know. Oh well. Send these two back, though. 
I defend a region against termites. But I'm not actually wounded, so stop. And these are just workers, so, you know. One of those two groups, technically. You don't really want to send the gunners in unless you have to. At least not in front of, you know, a war, a warriors. Gunners are supposed to stay in the back. Warriors of Inter Combat. The problem though is, oh shit. Um, that's bad, actually. That is really bad. Uh, gunners. They're actually just. First, I think they're probably heading towards the nest, and that's is actually fine, so long as they don't engage the workers. Of course, I can't pull back my warriors, so my warriors should be done, though, shortly. Okay, now. Or, oh no, workers engaging them. Uh, well, workers versus workers should be fine. For the most part. Besides, if they find the nest and them, they should be, yeah, good point. And then pilot the just enter your allegiance back to Babacon. Now so much for you know dealing with resources. Just this for now we just leave. I know, right? Just pack it up and leave. So much for maintaining this outpost. <laughs> and gathering word or anything. Now we're just gonna leave up and leave. Basically, that was a, tu a simple tutorial on basically how to command the regions and minor base stuff. Some of the other ones are going to become a bit more complex. You know, learning about using powers and all the power upgrades and upgrading your tiers of chemical laboratories and that. But yeah, pretty straightforward. Very straightforward. And then we go back to Belcon. Good old Belcon. Uh, I believe we have two more missions. Yes, no, maybe. Pat it through, yeah, through, yeah, two more missions. And this hasn't changed, so yeah. As I bounce off everything at high speed. So yeah, the one over here in the Golden Beetle Cave, you know, the Golden Beetle Cave. <coughs> <coughs> Fortification. Oh no, sir, it's a tape three. Are you busy? We need help. Uh, our younger sister, we appear to move for south of Eastern Outpost. Our progress is slow and they need your experience. Any dangers? I would point but stay alert. So we had encounters with spiders in the area. We fought hard. So the only left is that person to be quiet. So in that. Which have spread to enemy can only send in inexperienced workers. Season sisters after yourself might show these newborns how to fight. Uh oh, why some of the younger ones? Hey, you get a help and curious to see the world. What did you do the first time you really You probably ran outside to find a way to help your sisters, I'm sure of it. Yeah, I'll go there immediately. So time to learn how about fortification. Yay, fortification. Neutral Nettles and tier 4 one foraging points could be easily captured with a tier 1, single tier 1 ant legion. So, we have our base here. Oh, that's not good. So, 
Seriously, so we can't really move our gunners. Now we can. The gunners should not be fighting workers. That's a bad. The whole rock, paper, scissors thing. And so long as the warriors are attacking, the gunners can be pulled back out outside of, you know, bad range. I want to tear one out of tier three. Now we have to go build an economy. I know, right? That's a supply nest. That's the hunting headquarters. We're gonna go build a chemical laboratory over here at the hunting headquarters. High hunting headquarters. So. Oh. Uh, let's see, where is it? Economy, and that's information. Well, you know, we could be able to call our photographers over here, too. Okay. Well, that's going. We want to go back. There we go, yes. Then over to, over to economy, we want a chemical laboratory. I, I know, right? Now, why would it expect ants to have a chemical laboratory? Oh, uh, so eventually we can have upgraded ones of those. Okay, we also need to build a mushroom farm and a wood yard. So, we're gonna go over here to this other nest. You know, it's a supply one. We're gonna go over here and we'll build... You know, it could be mushroom yard. We're gonna build basically one at each. So, yeah, that one's our mushroom one. And then we'll go all the way over here. Economy. Oh, fuck, I forgot about something. I'm supposed to be looking for the golden beetle, ain't I? Well, you know, we'll go look for the golden beetle now that we've got stuff going. Where would I be if I was a golden fuck beetle? So they want to be able to the veteran cartographers, which. By the way, veteran cartographers, yeah. Might be that question mark, actually. Let's go investigate that question mark. These are pill bugs. Pill bugs are whatever. Fuck off, pill bugs. No. I wonder if I could recruit pill bugs. And use them as, like, defense balls. Let's see if this question mark is anything. Ah, uh, the question mark is that. Hmm. So yeah, the veteran cartographers we could deal with, we can make. But, we should probably also look for our good old friend the Golden Beetle first. If I were to go and beat it, where the fuck would I be? Probably someplace uphill. That's what I would say. Oh, there's a high bar of fly. Okay, oh god, we're stuck on this thing. We're stuck. We're doing loops. Okay. Well, let's go take a little peeky poo. Do you see a golden beetle? I do not see a golden beetle. Well, I thought it was a decent idea. The problem though is that fucker could be anywhere. As evidence from our first part. But how I do like the mini map thing. But I remember, always remember to get cartographers if you can. So that way you can, you know, actually see shit. Because seeing shit helps a lot. Gives you the mini map. Having a mini map helps. Um. No, that. Are you? Shit, I can't tell if that's a thing or not. I need to get up though. Shit, 
Actually, I can't tell if that's a thing or not. Crap, now I lost track of it. I'm not, it's probably just part of the stick. Yeah, we can't go this far. Can we? Huh. I think it was just part of the stick I saw. It looked slightly different. Oh well. Oh well, golden beetle, golden beetle, golden beetle, golden beetle. If I was a golden beetle, where would I be? Hmm. 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 Okay. <laughs> I've overheard this log. The side? No. Yet. Yeah. No. Oh yeah, I'm stuck on this. Okay, stop. Okay, what well, if it's between like the bark and the wood? The tree itself. The log, I should say. Oh god, that would mess with me, wouldn't it? That'd be a dick move to hide between them. Huh. I don't see anything. Oh, hi, bye. Hmm. Oh, this goes over here pretty far, doesn't it? This little thing. Hmm. Hmm, indeed, you say. Why do you go out this far? Weird. Huh. Nothing. Bah, 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 Nothing. Okay, okay. Well, yeah, you know, we have to go all the way over this way too. Gotta be fucking thorough. Which sucks. Okay. Do, 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 do. Can't play C. Pill bugs. <laughs> Whatever. Patrick crush mark on the main map. Okay. Need to stop running over and just climb uphill. Climb over hill. No, there's nothing else. Well, fuck me running. Well, where's it going to be? Oh, when you need a one. Okay. There's a like overhill past these fuckers. 
I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe not. Maybe not. Right, too far away. Okay. Huh. Huh. Rest is starting to hurt. Fuck. Ow. Ow, that hurt. Alright. So. Stop. I was going to be to where the fuck would I be? Okay. There's a, uh, you know, five bucks, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, the five, uh, lost my rod. Okay, the five rod is 172 food. But where is Golden Bead? George Ness, Hunting Headquarters. Hmm. Hmm. Sure, he's not like on this place somewhere. Huh. No. That's a decent place to hide one. Hmm. on the rock wall. I can't tell. I don't see anything golden. Okay. Hmm. 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 I'm going to have to cut the video until I find this asshole. Apparently, mass food storage has been reached. You hiding here in the shrubbery? If you're hiding here in the shrubbery, that's a bad. Hmm. Probably over there in that corner. Hiding like halfway between the bark and the wood, like a dick. No. No. I don't think you are. That would be a dick move. You're hiding like in hell. Noises, eh? Hmm. Oh. Oh. oh, oh, oh. Aha! I found you. Well, at least you make noise.
Okay, try to remember that noise. Noise is like that. There we go. That's fine, I can work with that. So yeah, we did it, we got the bag. Ugh. Now I can focus on, you know, doing this thing. We need veteran cartographers. So my clients even more stuff. Um, what do we need? Information. So you upgrade your cartographers. Displays all your nests and physical legions on the mini-map. Can I be built once? This, though, displays all legion regions by colors, controlled by you blue, contested yellow, and enemies red. This upgrade can be built once. Basically, upgrade our cartographers. Which... Now I know everything is purple, for some reason. Go for a scale main map with that, but... So now we need to go game power switch. Pretty sure this one here is already almost full, but... Yeah, and then enough chambers. We need chambers, so let's go over here to like... Uh, let's say this one all the way over here. Do, 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 Let's go learn about powers. So powers. They're shielding spores, which is basically chitin hardening spores grants the potential share of 3% of the legion cell. We can't really do that because it's already built. Instead, we can go over here and reinforce the call. Call to reinforce, which is why we have to play each other 30 seconds. Okay. So now then, select your warriors and aim at their nest and then hold down. So, basically, aim at the... Gunners, eh? Basically, aim at this, and since we know these are gunners, we spin this to upgrade our gunners. We now have veteran gunners. And this one here belongs to our warriors. So we upgrade, and now we have warriors. And that one... Doesn't have anything apparently. So yeah. Following those is gonna take X amount of time, so we just throw some extra food at them. And we throw some extra food at them. So it no longer takes, you know, two minutes to upgrade them. And now we know those fire bugs over there, right? Firebugs or whatever, so we're just going to send a warrior to deal with them. So a warrior's already heading though, and then we send you guys. Okay, you should reinforce our common extra legions by having two. The problem though is we don't really need to, because none of them are hurt. We don't really need to heal them. We'll see once we go in. I like how they don't want us to use our, you know, our one power. Shooting! Oh, we took them down. Auto hearing! My hearing. I think. I think we're using it. I don't know. Are we using it? Maybe. Oh, I have to hold to my bad. Boosh. There we go. Uh, investigate this. Send to the closest nest. And we went. Huzzah. 
Okay. Better Farrakhan. Yeah, I think we could deal with the net. Well, the, yeah, we could deal with the net of our tutorial things, and then we'll call it. Ah, uh, the next one's. That's one space for the one I already did and then realized that hey, I should probably have been looking for collectibles before I just dealing with it. This one's a bit rough. Uh, let's see. This one's basically how hey, you defend. The problem is you focus on defending and that means you don't focus on, you know, winning. Finding collectibles. Everyone knows how pretty sure now Pops is being attacked. You know, the one we just did. Do you want to hang down a resource and our sisters? Your knowledge and experience are required on the battlefield. The picture of Pavcon depends on it. How many termites? We quite indicate legions of termites. Several groups traveling separately. Give me a chance. Termites are powerful, but if I use the weakness to win the battle. But there was a way, oh, there was a way. Or we could sign a peace tree. Young Ant might see a German as a sibling. They're smart, also, let me see. And have a queen. If they do not eat meat, and do they lack our curiosity. Well, the difference is they must be on their so I do not mistake them for friends or allies. Since the dawn time and terrorist dusk, you must have been and will be our enemies. Okay, I'll head right there. So, yeah, defense mission. It's warm, it's dry, it's daylight. Basically, we have legions and they want to see the band. The one basically, I don't think the thing starts until you build the defense section. Basically, means. Oh, wait. There's no collateral for this one? Oh. Oh. But there's like two. There. So, what you're saying is I don't have to worry about collaterals? Okay, before we start this mission, or ban this mission, I want to go back to the main menu real quick. I want to go verify that. Are we actually 100% on... Oh. Oh. Well, apparently... It gets rid of the replay thing. Huh. Well, that's interesting. Oh god, that means I have to go all the way back to the thing. Okay. Huh. Well, it's nice knowing there's not actually a thing I need to worry about then. Ah. Huh. Okay, so these ones must be all nets too. Okay, so that means we are pretty much good. I can work with pretty much good. He's totally a friend. He's totally a fellow ant. Totally. Okay, so what you're saying is I don't have to worry about collections? On this one? Okay, that's actually pretty nice since this one's one that you can easily forget all about looking for anything anyway. Besides, we already... Maybe it's because we already got the one... It's basically the same as the other one. Maybe that's why. I don't know. Anyway, I'm headed there right now. Okay. So if I don't have to worry about collections, I want this for you first. So we go over here and we go to defense section. Defense section. So basically, we can build net scanners, we can build veteran net scanners, we can build slime reserves. Okay. Well, first things first, build. Build wood builder. They're not stars. No. Well, what about They're not stars. Okay, let's get to work. Okay, so first things first. Green. Oh shit, green, go do that. I made a mistake. Made a mistake. Okay. 
There we go. There we go. So workers go to gunners, warriors go to uh, workers, and gunners go to gunners. Simple as that. Those are the all tier two, aren't they? Yes. Veterans. They should be fine. We do have the three ability if need be. Which we shouldn't really need to. Well, maybe for our workers. Maybe for our workers. I can speed up construction, but we don't have that much work, so. Seven minutes is. Yeah, I won't spend all my word on that though. The problem though is there's no resources for us to buy collect. This is literally just a defense. And we get resources over time, but yeah, not enough to speed that up. We're gonna need like a lot more resources than we have. We have more powers and defense and stuff, but I don't know if I can do that again. Because let's face it, defenses. Oh, defenses all cost wood. We do not have wood. Powers, though. Well, powers you can play around with, I guess. Oop, I said powers you can play around with. Dash pheromones is the thing we can do. Rage pheromones is the thing we do. Good rage pheromones, and I don't think we have enough left for any of them, except for maybe. Or rage pheromones. Double rage pheromones, anyway. Okay, so. Go do that. Um, you guys go do that. You guys. Um, well, how do I? Pew 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 pew. Yeah, I can't really upgrade with our hill. Oh my legions, there we are. Workers engage with the angry angry Oh two charge when we actually both. Oh well, have fun. Keep your head cards while well, they're attacking my head. Probably bad. Okay. Workers. Yo, that Okay, warriors. Go to a bat. Green. Go to a bat. There we go. Nice.
So, wait, where is workers? Do they... Are they not sitting workers in yet? Now, you guys... Go fast. Not charged yet. Ugh. Hell. Oh no. There they are. Wait, 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 wait. No. I mean, you guys turn fast. Uh, I need you guys to go. Go faster. No. Wait, those? No, those are work those. Anything else for you guys to do with? No, not really. Yeah. The Nash is under attack. Oh no. Oh, I like shields. No. And we should be fine. We should be fine. Yeah, it's basically rock, paper, scissors. That's all you have to know is rock, paper, scissors. And then you have these powers just because, you know. Why not? Why are they not dead yet, by the way? Murder them. Apparently we need mass too. Yeah, our defense is never... They might have got well Nah still fake minutes. Never mind. Oh no. However shall we get all the way over there? That's actually bad. Pull those guys back. Workers pull back. Uh, this would be a good place to use this if I had to, you know, charge. Buy it down. Yeah, I'm barely starting my nest, anyway. Barely starting my nest. You guys got a bit wounded, so I'll, I'll help you guys out. Here you. Any gunners for you guys to do? No. I mean, it's pretty straightforward, just, yeah. And then we, you play the waiting game. Ooh, the waiting game. Power, if you want to, you can, you know, do that too. Don't help out. Because workers could beat gunners, but if your gunners are behind your warriors, then your worker, then the workers are not focusing on your gunners, and your gunners can easily help murder the good workers because your warriors are murdering the gun uh, workers. I know, right? Comparison, but yeah. I think we're good. I think we're good. That's it. It's straightforward. It's pretty straightforward mission. Just. Send them to the spots to defend against the ones they counter. And I think that's it for Belcon. Uh, so yeah, then we move on to the flood. Uh, the flood sucks. Well, one mission really sucks for it. Where it's basically go f rescue several. So worker ants. The problem though is getting to that it could basically sort of soft lock. And by that I mean it basically you rescue them, but at the same time you don't rescue them. Like there you can lose some and then you won't be able to actually complete the mission. And yet the mission won't just fail. It'll just stay going. And then you'll just be stuck there. What oh three six eight three? Glad I found you so quickly. Oops, my bad. Moments of mission for you, an urgent one. 
He wants to talk to you as soon as possible, so hurry. What's it about? No idea. Because you are about to use less talkative than usual. Do you know anything? What's coming slowly? But this is after the Federal just they're strong and powerful. When you think about it, there are so many of us uh, in this forest. More than all the grains of dirt we moved to build Belkan. Is Belkan awake now? Almost. Many of us are just a hard work. If they want us to do is help the neighbors wake up. Share their food or drop their water to care where waking up is easier. Well, I will go see her right away. Gotta go see the lover. Gotta, gotta go that way. That, that way. Forward. Forward momentum. Why am I going this way? The speed. The speed. So yeah, you can't really explore around inside. It just takes you to, you know, where you need to go. Because the camera would have issues. Given how it's designed. The mirrors is entirely too loud for this section, but yeah. Oh, were you called for me? Yes, I have heard one of my daughters saved our southwestern outpost. I do what was best for the Federation mothers. You show the initiative in the right direction. That's how my daughter should act to protect her beloved home. There's another miniature federation is facing. A flood is rising around the city of Tayakan. Was Tayakan built next to a river? Not at all, but they don't have a plan to deal with a flood. They need help. That's why we want you to lead seven legions of workers to Tayakan. You have to scout way through the waters. Was there should I inquire about the source of the flood? Find what caused it? Oh, my dear child, you don't have to worry about that. Alfred's will. Focus your cunning and energy on helping Tayaka. Report to Queen Tayunini. Tayuni. It seems the city can be saved, or if the population must be orderly evacuated. Gather in seven legions. That will force me to deplete your spring collection effort. Belkan will miss out on some opportunities, but we are strong and Taikan is very important to us. It's halfway between here and the end of the world. Precisely the region where we need to keep the Velcroing slowly but always forward, as we always do. Right, I wish I was separate the legions immediately. Where were we now? We were at peace with the termite cities in that region, but the flood might have upset and unsettled them too. Remind them of their place if needed. I will be the claw that strikes if I must. And away we go. So, yeah. Now we move on to the Flood in Southwestern Belcon. This one sort of sucks. Firstly, we need to get to the place. Which, yeah, exploration. Which, by the way, I think I missed, um, Fletcher. First, I missed about Beetle Hill. And that's about all we missed here, I'm pretty sure. So yeah. Oh, so now we can go back here. And by the way, since we technically completed everything in Barracon, you could technically go back and... Oh, nope, it doesn't... 
the option's not there, everyone. The option's not there. So here I was complaining about there not being an option. Well, hey, look. There's no option. You can see why you upset me. I guess you have to actually reach this thing before it pops up, but yeah, that's stupid. Anyway, that's... Yeah, this is Empire of the Ants. Ugh. Yeah, the next mission is gonna suck. Especially the, the one where it's basically like, oh, well, you need to go rescue these ants. By the way, if the flood wars get too high, they start dying, and yeah, then you can't complete the mission. It doesn't tell you that you can't complete the mission. It just lets you keep going, and problems you can't complete the mission because they're already gone. You have to sort of know exactly where they're at, which is, takes trial and error, unfortunately. But anyway, next time, hope you all enjoyed. Thank you all, and have a nice day.